Good morning. Happy Tuesday. It is spring break around here. I am making my morning coffee. I'm not completely pulled together, but that's okay because I have plans. I have plans to take care of my daughter's room. So spring break, what does a homeschool mom do? Sometimes we take days off in a way, half days, whatever, we can do those things. So my daughter's room, I've kind of let it explode. Have you ever let a room explode just to kind of attack it in one foul swoop? <laughs> you know, just fly through like a bird and just clean it on up. I wanted to see what was working and what was not. I have a pretty good idea of what is not working because that stuff is what's puked all over her floor. Yeah, we're not proud of it, but we're gonna take care of it. I'm gonna do three fifteens. So I actually even written down, read it down, read it down. Coffee. Oh, it's black, but it's gonna help. Woo. Um, I wrote. <laughs> I is a teacher. I am a teacher. My goodness. Um. I'm gonna do three 15s. So for all you math people, that's gonna be 45 minutes, hopefully not an hour, that I'm going to go into her room and tackle it. I can't do long sessions because I do have my kids at home and you can actually hear. They're watching a morning show, which doesn't usually happen, but today it is and Lightning McQueen toy is sounding. Anyway. 3.15, we're gonna see how it goes. I'm gonna set up the tripod and go for it. I'm gonna take you along as much as I can um, on this reordering of my daughter's room because it really needs it. So what does a homeschool mom do, do during spring break? I guess at this point, we regain control of our household things. So that's what we're gonna do. Okay, I got my coffee, so maybe things will improve in my language skills. We are just going to have a gentle morning and I'm gonna have them do their show and I'm gonna start on the first 15 and see how it goes. So, ready or not, here I come. <laughs> I find sometimes when a task seems so insurmountable, just break it up, let's get to it. Here I am calmly surveying the wreckage, carefully calculating the risk and <laughs> the method. Let's start our timer. Let's get this thing done. In enters the Norwex mop, or my stuff flinger. <laughs> uh, I use this for the proper use, but this is an improper use, but hey, gets the job done. Get it in a big pile, start sorting, throwing away, whatever your process is. This really helps getting it all in one place. this while you watch me clean why don't you take a couple minutes and tidy something that you have to tidy I have watched my personal share of cleaning videos and have sat there and just watched and maybe got some inspiration at the end but just enjoying me clean my space hey that's great but why don't you find something in your home I challenge you Take one set of 15. This video is about 
15 or so. Go ahead and find something to tidy. Put in an earbud and enjoy meeting with me. Okay, so. It's been, it's too early for math. <laughs> 11 minutes. So we got like four or something left. So I'm actually gonna pause it. Give myself some time. So I got four minutes or so, give or take left um let me show you what i got done. okay so <clears throat> we have stuffies and things she is gonna take part what happened was she got into some of the storage rotating toys we were pulling out and she pulled out a bunch of stuff so we turned into a problem that was a mommy bad for leaving it out <laughs> these are toys that go elsewhere legos always legos always that. Here's our little pile. Here's our trash bin. Piles for artwork. My daughter does a lot more artwork than my boys, so she does have a lot more paper flowing through her room, so we just deal with it, but I do like that she creates. This bin's full of stuff. <laughs> um, probably next 15, we'll do that. My daughter really enjoys, um, you know, I already said crafting. And she is an organized girl in her own way. Like these are her special things. Let's see if I can pull these out. She keeps them in a bag, which is nice because she likes to bring them where she goes. So these are her Hatchimals she got in a recent Goodwill haul. What's in the bag? These are some Play-Doh items from her Easter. So I mean, she's an orderly little girl. Like she knows these are her special things. She's got her chick. I actually have to reclaim that. She's got some of her street chalk. A pair of her brother's glasses. That's kind of random. Some more um, erasers and crayons. See how she puts them all in a baggie? And she's like her mama. She's orderly, but sometimes it's not, you know, practical. I wish she could put all her special things in her desk. Because her little brother. This is our special things. I'm going to leave that here for her to go through. Her brother, brother likes to um, get into things, so sometimes she has to have them put up. She has to have them with her. She likes to bring them on the go. I'm thinking I'm going to try to make her desk in here a place where she can store, whoa, she can store her special things and then, you know, maybe keep the bag in there so it has a spot. <clears throat> So that's the rest of what we have. I got some books sorted out, some things that go into her desk. I usually don't sort and clean and purge at the same time, but it looks like I did this time and that's just okay. I was just trying to do it in a couple minutes. So I'm gonna take my last four minutes and make sure that this stuff doesn't get messed up while I take my break. So putting the bins maybe along the wall. So I'll, I'll do that. Right and I know, though the winter is long, even richer, the harvest it brings. Though my waiting prolongs even greater, you promise for me like a seed. I believe that my season. So that's that for my first 15. Um, I had a couple minutes to spare, but hey, that's pretty good. Things are categorized. I feel good. I did my 15. There was a couple times while I was cleaning, I was looking at my watch because I was like, I don't wanna be doing this no more. I wanna go drink my coffee. I don't wanna be sitting in here. My kids are still watching their show, which is gonna be um, probably a little bit longer this morning and then we're gonna get outside. but. That's my first 15. I'll see you for the next 15. Ready for take two? All right, so we are going to take another 15 minutes. 15 minutes. Lord, I think of your love Like the love of it. 
that was about six minutes. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. Got all of these pens and pencils and things like that. This is something I actually have to go through because she can't keep them clean on her own. So I'm not gonna expect her to because that's a difficult thing. So in her room, she's responsible for all of her stuff and it's not all hers, or not all her fault, I should say, because she's got little siblings. They come in here and they play and things come from upstairs and they just get kind of lost. So my kids are responsible to keep their own rooms clean and we did kind of, like I said, let it go a little bit. So we are gonna handle it. This was good. This little pile is all that's left after that six minutes. So I got quite a bit more time here in this room. And I know though the winter is long even richer the harvest should praise though my waiting prolongs even greater you promise for me like a seed I believe I can see the future, you're the god of seasons, and I'm just in the winter. If all I know of harvest is that it's worth my patience, and if you're not done working, then God, I'm not done waiting. You can see my promise. I'm pretty good. I did some things off camera, so I got six minutes down, and her bed is covered in toys, but we're going to work on that. And I'm gonna take a little break here and get myself something to eat this morning and check on the kids, but I still have my timer for what I have left. So that's what I'm gonna do now. Even in the winter, cause you're the God of greatness. Even in a manger, for all I know of seasons is that you take your time. You could have saved just in a second. Instead you send a child. Well, it's stopping time again. 15 minutes went off and I vacuumed and I did a bunch of other things off camera. So that's the second 15 that's looking pretty good. She just has her part on the bed. <laughs> but we're gonna get that taken care of and it's going to go very well. I know it will.
so time was up. I think it went well. We did a good job. I'm gonna mop the floor real quick and that's just a quick job. So we did it, we did it. And I'm so thankful. So thank you for joining me and I pray that this is a blessing to you. Subscribe, like, all the things, and we'll see you next time.